G'day, Pierina with Fight Clinic. We are up at Ama Gym in Balcatta with David Creel. Hi. Talking about his upcoming fight and his history. We have an upcoming title fight. Do you want to tell us about it? Um, sure. Uh, so it's just for WKA, national title. Um, from 67 to 65, weight class. And yeah, it sort of just popped up with the opportunity about a month ago. And that's pretty much all, pretty much it. And Four uh, full tie rules and what, whatnot. Very cool. When when is the fight? Um, next week in so on the eighth of April. At at uh, Craigie Leisure Centre. Do you like to study an opponent before a fight? Not so much. I might like watch like a few of their fights, but I was never big into really like looking fight after fight what they're doing. I was sort of more care what I do, well, my own preparation. You know, so I focus on myself rather than always like looking at what they do. But yeah, I do like watch a little bit, but not for hour. Do you alter your training leading into a fight? Yeah, a little bit. Like so if the opponent's tall, you know, you wanna you wanna set up combos that's gonna work against a tall opponent. If it's your own size then you know you have a different approach. But yeah, for sure. Can you tell us about your fight career leading up to now? Um I guess like I just started off like having, you know, wanting a one fight just to see what it feels like. And then you have one fight and then you like, you know, jump for the next one. I was never, I was actually never meant to have so like, keep fighting, but I sort of just fell into it and you sort of get addicted to it a little bit. You know, and once you have one fight, you always go, oh, one more, one more, one more, one more. So, and that's pretty much how it happened. Like, pretty much just wanted to get, like, be able to fight, learn how to do it. I thought we'd you know, jump into one fight, and yeah, now I'm here doing this national fight. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about your this gym and your trainer. Um, sure. Um, so, Academy of Mixed Martial Arts. Uh, so we specialise in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu and Muay Thai, and a bit of MMA. Um, my trainer, Brett. Like probably my favorite person and most hated person. Nah, <laughs> nah, he's um, nah, he's like, in my opinion, one of the best Muay Thai trainers in WA, if not Australia. Like, like pretty much everything I know from Muay Thai, all my technique comes from him. And like when it comes to trainer and student, like it's a, it's a love hate thing, you know. Like he'll train you so hard that you hate him at one point, but but then you love him too. But um. Yeah, he's an intense guy, but also like a bro and a mate. You know. Do you have a signature move or technique? No, not really. Like when you fight train for you fight, like it changes. You know, like one fight your elbows might be your favorite, the thrusting elbow. Then you come to the next fight, and then like I really work my switch kick, and I start loving that. And the next fight, you get um get my right kick going or right jumping roundhouse, and. Then you start go start going back to overhands, body rips. So it changes every time. So no no specific favorite one. Um, trying really hard to like learn the Nakago kick at the moment, but uh, I love I love all of them. <laughs> David, thank you for your time. It's been awesome chatting with you, and I wish you all the best for your future. You're so welcome. Thank you for coming by. <laughs> Right.